I grew up in Alabama. I really thought I was going to end up playing basketball. I happened to fall into football, and, and football has been kind to me. I had to, had to keep on playing and try to stake my claim in this game, and especially after I signed my, my big contract, you know, with the New York Jets. Four, two, nine, with the slip, with the slip. And now it's eight years from me. I think my time in New York had ran out. My course there was over. My chance for me to get a fresh start in Arizona was welcome and needed. The uh, Cardinals showed how much they wanted me to be there and how much they wanted me to be a part of what they were doing moving forward. First year I came back to Arizona, team MVP, so it showed a lot for me and really welcomed me there with open arms, the organization and the fans as well, so it was a great. You know, happened to end up being one of the better safeties in the league. I think a blessing and something that I'm glad I did. It's all about football and it's all about football. When that season's over, I do the production stuff that I want to do big time. Acting a little bit, I want to do a little bit of that as well. For sure, five years from now, I see myself getting myself closer and closer to that Hollywood star I've been thinking about for, for a couple years now. That's my second occupation. They just don't know it yet. I just haven't got hired by anybody, but it's my second occupation. <laughs> Come on, Eileen, give me work. To play good, you have to look good. Vote for Mega Chunk. Post me that. This time is the day. I got a cut for you. I got, I got, I got one, two, three, six cuts. <laughs> The team and having some people around you and, and in your circle that you know you can trust and know that has your best interest at hand is it's the only way to be in this life. Let me have my client so I can get started. Something is always new with me. In the point of my life I'm in right now, I needed somebody to come in. Oh, I am the assistant that creates teams for famous people. My right hand man, he's my right and my left. He takes care of anything I need to get taken care of. Carrie is like my brother. I'm the boss. Oh, really? Um, yes, ma'am. I'm over everyone, so being the boss always works. <laughs> um, time is money. Do he know this? <laughs> it can only ramp your, your style and game up to another level. So you already know. Louis Vuitton. Can I borrow new? Stop and shop and shop. That's all I do. Louis Vuitton. Small clothes. Prada, size 29. I'm allergic to like Prada. A lot of people have never seen a size 29. It's just cute. Nice and petite. Mike has been my trainer for two years now. This is some bullshit. That he keeps me very thin. Okay. That's what I pay you for. It's a lady, so I can eat red yellow cake if you work me out. That's what I pay you for. To keep my body crazy and I eat what I want to eat. The reason why I'm still in size 29. I think my spine just broke. I'm gonna actually get that's the clear. We're gonna head on back. Right down a little bit. Right there. Um, Gucci. Well, are these Gucci? Who uses a Gucci chair? Right? The camera doesn't put weight on me like you do some people. I am working out two miles every day, juicing. Something is stuck on my foot, y'all. Get it? It's sticking me. So you gonna pee? This is the devil. What if your snake meet a snake? I, I what? Meeting him was one of the best best days of my life. So fat, I can't do it like I used to. One thing good. <laughs> I need a man do. I'm gonna do it the Hollywood way. Uh -huh. ah. Help run my team to get my team together. Makes my life stress free. I don't know if I can do it. For the world, I don't know if the world's ready for Hollywood yet, but we'll see. I'm an assistant who does everything. So he has to make sure everything is perfect so I won't go off. 15, 17 hour days. It's my good night. Guess what time it is. Everybody's gonna work out. Sacrifice a lot and I've worked hard. Monday. I got him, I got Alton in here with me right now. Early in the morning, he don't get no rest. That's my job, I'm supposed to help him focus. Let me see, we can probably, we can go right there. I can range from the accountant to the janitor. The 280, we're thinking about 280. We need a tour guide. I'm not used to this type of shit. This is maybe one of the hardest jobs in America. 
I've been complaining the whole time I've been coming up here. Like, oh my God, it's curve after curve. You know Alton can't drive. No matter what Holly says, he loves this. He does, because he's going to see the views now. Non-stop. Ah, I don't like this. I'm ready to go. Oh, he stays on me. Alton! 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 Yeah. But I'm confident. I know I can do it. Everything that you can think of, I will do it. If Alton do something wrong, this is ass. I didn't know it like the back of my hand. I'm like, hold up. Again, this wisdom too full. Well, first bite of meat. And he still has yeah. stitches in his mouth. And I'm <laughs> eating a fucking salad and he's gonna try a burger. So tonight is Celine Dion. Let's go, Celine Dion. You rock. Yeah. This should be for me. I'm trying to convince JD to get a Caesar salad. I don't know why he right didn't right now. get nothing. I had a 12 pack of Mountain Dews. He drank oh, oh, eight. Oh, we, we woke up. We were, at my, we, we, we were at my house in uh, in my house in Hawaii and woke up in the morning and the box was we gone. Get, get one, my but he woke up and said he didn't drink them. Sorry. JD had drunk a whole cold. <laughs> they were gone. <laughs> Empty bag of chips. But so, he had, so he had a whole so feast what? at night. All he did that night was walk and eat. <laughs> <laughs> you want a good skin? Oh. Give him a case of mayonnaise. <laughs> Something. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, damn, I woke up for my hoagie. Do the do the do. Gone.